Hello fellow YouTubers, this is Pirate Bandit coming at you again today and uh, today I'm going to release and uh, show you a uh, application called uTorrent. As you can see I already have it downloaded and installed and you can find the download link in the uh, description box below this video. Um, uTorrent, quick description for those who aren't familiar with it, it is a um, compression program kinda like WinZip and WinRAR the only difference is WinZip and WinRAR they um, they extract compressed zip files or RAR files um, uTorrent deals strictly with torrent files um, the only difference is, is it compiles more information into one source so it's easier to download and quicker than multiple sources or multiple like EXEs or videos. So in this demonstration and tutorial, or I'm going to open my uh, Maxthon browser three, which was in one of my previous videos. And for those who aren't familiar with that, it is a split screen um, browser. Allows you gives you the capability of uh, browsing um, multiple sites so on the left here we are going to open which I already have um, utorrent.com backslash downloads and this link is going to be in the description um, we're gonna go down to uh, utorrent stable and go ahead and download that and um, uh, set it up on your computer go through the setup process um, uTorrent is available in Windows, Mac, and Linux for those who aren't familiar with the uh, torrent program. Um, so once that's downloaded, we're going to go ahead, minimize this, and uh, you're going to have a uh, uTorrent icon on your desktop. It's going to be a green circle with a, a white U in the middle of it. And um, this is a pretty much when you open it this is what uh, the torrent is going to look like the uh, program except it's not going to have this file in it um, that's there for um, towards the end of this tutorial um, I'll show you why that's there um, we're going to minimize this and um, just because now that you have uTorrent um, downloaded on your uh, uh, computer now you have to find um, torrent files to download. Um, some torrent files sharing sites are uh, are free, um, some aren't, and some are just a cluster of um, ads. Um, I'll show you two torrent sites real quick. Um, one torrent site is uh, going to be uh, Pirate Bay. Um, the piratebay.se torrent site is this one here on the left and um, this one I do not recommend because it's kind of hard to understand um, you can search for anything for audio video applications games and other um, for example we'll put in a, a application here um, for uh, Maxthon um, browser and we'll see if that pulls anything up and it didn't so um, Pirate Bay doesn't even have a Maxthon browser download so let's do a movie let's do wrong turn 5 it's a new movie out um, this is the usage for uh, oh, I forgot the space there. This is the usage for um, torrent sites is to access new um, new files, whether it be movies like you know Wrong Turn Five. You got four, three, and two available. Um, this site I don't recommend. All it does is show the seeds and the leeches. Um, the higher number of seeds, the better download speed for the torrent is going to be. Um, like I said, you can tell there's download buttons everywhere for advertisements. 
it's it's pirate the pirate bay.se site is just really confusing and a waste of time honestly um, if you're going to use a site I would prefer um, kickasstorrents.com also known as kat.ph um, that's the site here that I am on and um, it is a lot more um, understanding and uh, easier to maneuver around and it's a lot more detailed when it comes down to um, accessing and uh, downloading torrent files uh, for example you have movie torrents, TV show torrents um, things of that nature, game torrents um, as you can see you know uh, application torrents you know you have format factories and stuff like that now you have four buttons here um, this one it, um, has a little chat symbol on it that's a comment button that is people who have downloaded this this torrent and have rated it and uh, commented on it um, overall 10 out of 10 that's good torrent um, 14 people commented on it the more people that commented in the higher rating for the torrent um, the better torrent it is but keep in mind you have to watch your seeds for example this has 61 and compared to this torrent it has four, uh, 1490 when you find a torrent that you're are satisfied with when it comes to the ratings comments and the seeds you're going to want to go ahead and um, click the download torrent file which is you want to click on the brown down arrow on this site and for this I'm gonna go ahead and um, I'm gonna go ahead and download a torrent that I haven't downloaded yet uh, under movies and uh, that's gonna go ahead and be um, let me close this out I'm gonna go ahead and download Killer Joe uh, it's a good torrent. It's got uh, 1,628 seeds, which should download fairly quickly. When you um, click the download torrent file, you're going to have this uh, download file come up. You don't want to save the torrent. All it's going to do is use up space on your uh, computer, and it's it's unnecessary. All you have to do is um, find the folder that you want to save save it to which in this case you won't be saving so just click open and when you click open of course your download manager is going to come up which there's no need for but um it's going to automatically uTorrent is automatically going to open and uh, Killer Joe is going to try to download now it's going to have a pop-up box that says save in and it's going to have the name of the torrent here you have the option of renaming the torrent um, to whatever you like um, and then choosing a folder that once the torrent is downloaded um, it's going to be accessed in in this case it's going to be in my downloads folder so I'm going to click OK and as you can tell it's going to be uh, start uh, downloading um, the more seeds you have the less um, less time you have to wait for the the file or the torrent file I should say to uh, become totally totally downloaded um, in this case um, it's going to start off your ETA on your estimated time of uh, download is going to be high but the more seeds found and the quicker your download speed goes it's, that's going to come down quick for example I have um, the Expendables 2 movie from 2012 um, it's completely downloaded when it when um file torrent file is completely download completely downloaded from uTorrent you're going to have a full green bar and it's going to say seeding when it says seeding that means other users who are trying to download this are pretty much going to upload it from you you're going to contribute to them downloading it um, when your um, torrent is downloaded you want to right click on the torrent you're looking at and click open containing folder that's going to show you the folder that the torrent is downloaded in for example this is in my downloads 
folder under the Expendables 2. Now, when you download movies and music, a lot of the times you're going to get a lot of extra uh, files. For example, this has a text document, system information, two video clips, uh, an MP4 video, and a file folder for subfiles. The only one you need is going to be the video clip that says the name of the torrent you downloaded. This here video clip is a sample. You don't need it. So you can go ahead and delete all these extra, you know, uh, documents and, 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 and folders and, and clips. You can download all of, or delete all of those. Um, make sure when you go to delete all of those that when in your uTorrent program that your file is not uh, in it otherwise it will say it cannot delete those uh, files that are in that folder anyways when uh, you, you go ahead and in this case you, you watch the movie and you like the movie go back into uTorrent and click this red X that says remove after you have highlighted and selected the torrent that you want to remove click remove and it will bring this pop up box this pop up box up this allows you to rate the movie in this case we're going to rate it five stars because it was a good movie and the quality was in audio was really good on this movie and we're just going to put great audio and video um, and then we're going to hit OK. What we just did is we contributed to our comments on that specific torrent file on that website. And this way we contributed to um, clarifying that yes it has great audio and video, it's a great file, and it's definitely worth the time to download. This is one of the great aspects of the Kickass Torrents uh, website for downloading torrent files is you have a community to share um, opinions about the um, the torrents that are accessible. So, with that said. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to uh, ask me in the comment section of uh, this YouTube video, and I will get back with you. But it's pretty much self-explanatory, and uh, just watch the video over one more time. And uh, if this helped you, go ahead and hit that like button down there, and I will be bringing more tutorial videos to you as soon as possible. This is Pirate Bay, and I will see you around. Take care.